Okay, so should now be live. Just letting Twitch load so that I can see. Yes, I'm now live. That's good. Get rid of the Discord, don't need that anymore. That's an amazing start. <laughs> so, that's causing that. Is it just my shitty mobile internet at the moment? Uh, if so, I apologise, but I'm at the whims of weather and signal. Which is not, of course, great in the middle of Scotland. So... Let me see. Hmm. Should be a lot better than this. I don't know why it isn't. Okay, let's just get started anyway. Uh, and you know, see if anything changes in the meantime. So, uh, when last we left off, again, went on a run of form, uh, I believe. 3 0 against SDVV, a very disappointing 2 2 rescued against. Uh, KV McKaylin, and then a superb 4 0 win against Vaslan Bavarin. Up next is Oipen, down in 13th place, but more importantly, the week after that is, of course, the unbeaten Club Bruges, who are going to be a very, very interesting opponent because at the moment they are three points ahead of us because we've lost a game and they haven't. They won that. They won that game where we lost. So it very much remains to be seen how we are going to do against them. Obviously, very much hope for a win. But can't guarantee anything moment. Yes, as it stands, we are in, we are, you know, we're good, uh, good value in second at the very least. Definitely can't deny that. Ooh, 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 ooh. Now isn't that an interesting sight. Nowhere near the best. Jens is our best left winger? Oh lord. I think that says something. Nowhere near the best in any position, but he plays three quite important positions and he has decent enough uh, future. Have a look at his stats. I mean, they're not amazing, but his mentals are good. Bravery and determination aside, his mentals and his composure decisions and off the ball are very good. Gonna add you to shortlist, my son. So that is a very interesting. Van der Voort, look at that, a 10. God damn, 10 out of 10 for training. Can't ask any more from Van der Voort. Cannot ask any more. Ah. So, 
So in your uh, in your regular weekly tech update from me in trying to fix quality issues, I have had a fiddle again. Uh, put it back onto the settings that I think uh, did the best in that you know there were the fewest amount of quality drops. So you know fingers crossed I'll do something. I did try and work with the resolution to try and drop the drop the resolution to see if that did anything but it didn't go well so uh, okay again not horrific mentals positioning leadership and concentration could do better leadership's not necessary not a massive necessity but it'd be good to have Concentration could probably do with that and positioning as well. I mean, he is a winger. He's also a striker. That's what is important, though. Of course, if he's not actually if he's not actually two and a half stars, he's two stars. That wouldn't be as helpful. Yeah. I'm shortlist still. Oh, Yakas. Poor, poor Yakas. Of course, he has no in transfer interest. Bloody, uh. I believe I found the scumbag who ruined this team so effectively. Uh. I believe it was, in fact, a bloke called Hans Wolf. Let's just see if we can find him here. Indeed, as you can see, he was most recently gank manager. And you were very, very bad. You bloody incompetent fool. Uh, let's get him until fit. Let's get him until fit. Let's get him until fit. And let's get... Oh, Blink can't be selected for match fitness. Okay, leave him as he is then. Yeah, Blin deserves it. He got himself bloody sent off like a chump. Like a bloody chump. Yeah, as it is, 2.3% of frames skipped due to encoding lag. It's frustrating. Anyway. Uh, Zebli put in a decent enough performance. He made nine appearances, seven average rating. That's not awful. I mean, this this season is very much a. There's not. I'm not really sure. Hundred percent how to uh, how to go about this. This season because of. The fact that I've got so many people on loan that will that are gonna come back at the end of the season. I don't want to obviously make a bunch of transfers. Not that I can, because of budget necessity. Uh but you know if I do bring in a bunch of new players and then suddenly the old players turn back up again, you know, it's Ooh. That's interesting. Yeah, I didn't think they would up the scout limit somehow. Okay, so I can bring in a new new uh, coach. I mean, we've got the highest average anyway, <laughs> but. But I'm still going to bring one in. Because I can more than anything else. Uh, let's get a performance analyst. Might as well have more than one. Might as well have more than one. Go away. So. I'd like to know the numbers. But, oh well. Stick to what we've got. So yeah, so it's sort of a hard. I mean, the issue, of course, is is that if I don't make any uh, any changes, 
Joss. I'm fairly sure he's... Joss, Joss, Joss. Yeah, he was the... He was the assistant manager when I first took over. What are you doing in the under-18s, man? I, I, I blame Wolf. I absolutely blame Wolf. Who's my assistant manager at the moment? Domenico Olivieri. I compare him with Joss. You see, you see, you see, you see. In general, Joss is a, other than technical, I suppose. And Joss is a perfectionist at that. Hmm. It'll be very interesting, very interesting to think of what I may do. He's not great at negotiating, but I, I take care of negotiating. I can work. I can negotiate fine. I might end up getting rid of him. Seems like a very much a, a a Hans Wolf man. I mean, that was that was going to be obvious, really, wasn't it? Is anyone actually surprised that uh, <laughs> the top of the table clash has been uh, televised? Let's see. Ooh, again, very interesting. I said I do have a lot of centre backs, and I'm already getting issues with one of them. Uh, no. Right. Yeah, I had a feeling. The squad player. Uh. Do you, though, Dries? Do you? Yeah. Right. Yeah, that's, that's not especially good. He is not happy with me, which... I can understand, but at the same time, I, I'm i trying to win a league here. Like, I don't really, I can't really, you know, afford to uh, start substandard players, especially with the Club Bruges game coming up. I mean, I would, you know, I would have. I mean, I was planning on starting Wooters in the uh, in the cup game that was after that. Nothing else to give people a rest. But at the moment, we've got you know a week between each game, which is it's pretty easy, it's pretty easy to not have to rotate at that point. Where are Oipen? Where are Oipen on there? Oh, they're up there. They allow a lot of shots, which is good. So you just have to be clinical. Uh, uh, same stats as before. Yeah, we're, we're doing well. We are doing well. Uh, start assignment, start assignment, leave the other one. Leave the other one. As said, I mean, look at the... Nigren, Fiolic, Borges, O'Day, and Paintsell are all going to come back. They're all two and a half stars, but all have the ability to grow. Borges and Fiolic, less so. Oh, God. Uh, where does Fiolic play? Attacking right and field. But, I mean, look at his stats. His mentals are not good, but he's got 17 crossings, 16 corners, 15 acceleration, 15 first touch, 12 passing. Man is a very good player. And he got sent out on bloody loan. Honestly, just 
And we lost another striker. Great, okay. Now, obviously, Nygren, the Swedish uh, you know, winger slash attacking player. I'm just going to say attacking player. Uh, best Belgian player. I mean... I know that he has the better average rating, but, you know, he plays in the what is, the Cyprus League. <laughs> the freaking, the freaking Cyprus League. So, yeah, whereas, you know, De Bruyne... 0 0.02 behind him. I think I'm going to go with De Bruyne on this one. I'll put you in second. And that guy. Uh, Zigwe Badibanga, whoever that is. Uh, Golden Boot. Is Golden Boot just best striker or huh. I mean either way Jens should be winning this but he won't Jens very much should be winning this ooh that's concerning already I'm voting for my players I show no you know uh Where's Miller? I don't care if it's biased. I support my players. <laughs> I can't vote for my players on this one. <laughs> if I did, it would be top. Questa is only uh, point zero seven behind uh, the Sharon, and Lakumi is well ahead. But I have no choice. Oh, I could abstain. I think I'm going to abstain. Same here. It's joint conceded, especially consider it's Mignolet. 32 years old. Martin is bloody 18. No real comparison, is there? Again, I'm, I'm, I'm abstaining. Because I don't think it's right that I can't vote for my players. Yeah, I was disappointed with that result as well, to be fair. Mm. I mean, Booters doesn't look to have that much of an influence on... Uh... <laughs> Nobody agrees with him, and DeVaced disagrees, disagrees with him. That's a right old... Uh... Right, I'll sod off to uh, Wooters. Where is Wooters in here? Where is he? Oh, there. Yeah. Where is he in the hierarchy? I can't find him. Oh, there. <laughs> He's not even in one of the... He's not even considered an influential player when he's been here for coming on six years. <laughs> I think that says everything about you, Dries. I think that says everything about you, buddy. Oh, good. Under-18s did well. That's Joss's, uh, Joss's influence for you. I'm, I'm going to end up bringing him back on as, as my assistant at the end of the season. I can already tell. I can already tell what I'm going to do. I should probably even just do it now, just to get it over with. But... <laughs> uh, yes. Offer you a contract. I can do that. The 
Negotiate. Uh, what's your current contract? 450. Drop that down to 900. Drop you to an even 5k. I like even numbers. Drop you to an even 200. Down to 5, and I'll agree to that. Okay, 950, 5k, 5%. Take it or leave it. Good, you took it. Uh, what position does he even play? Left winger. Or centre mid. Or left midfield. Either way. What about you? Centre back. <laughs> I'm not renewing Vukovic's contract. I'll find another keeper. I could probably have one in uh, probably have one in the under twenty ones or under eighteens that I could bring in. If only I still had Kook. You're getting the same offer as the last guy. Vaguely. Oh. Not happening. Take it or leave it. Trying my patience. There we go. They always come round. They always come round. Yeah. Ooh. This one wants a lot. Down to a K. Down to six. Down to five. There we go. You got a little bit more than the rest. It's fine. And there really, really isn't, but, you know. I mean, that's just. Struct, uh, director of football to do those negotiations. Uh, the rest of them, for the most part, I think I'm just going to let them run out, actually. The only one I want to do personally uh, is Zebley's. Okay. That's fine. What's he currently on? Upping that. Taking that down to 12. Five down to a down to a nice neat twenty k, nice neat four k, nice neat two point five. Awesome, I like Zebley. So, oh lord. Ooh, that's good. He's doing well. It's very good. See? Keeper. In fact, I'm going to go there now and see. Uh, look at that. 16-year-old. <laughs> I'll stick him in the team. It's fine. It's fine if we, uh, if we have <laughs> two goalkeepers under 20, right? <laughs> Perfectly fine. Uh, oh. They don't even have a keeper. I should give them one of the under twenty ones keepers. Uh Vic Chamberi. Actually I th I'm fairly sure I uh, he wants to go out on loan. I'm sure somebody else will take care of it. Recruitment meeting. Ten meeting. Really? I thought I had. I mean, there's only so many players under 21 that I can sign, man. Uh, let's see what they think. No. Uh, no. I agree with those two. I do agree with those two.
to see the suggestions. Unless you're willing to let me offer 52k, this is pointless. This is less pointless. Interesting. Keep scouting him. 26. Eh. Hmm. Uh, don't need to worry right now. Move on. See the reports. That'd be interesting seeing what your uh, your take on this role is, because I do agree we need we need need another striker, a very good one. That's the issue. Those are two of the those those are the big issues. Uh. That's right. I think I remember him. Yeah. I don't see why this is so low, actually. Because he seems very good. Well, scout him first. Scout him. Scout him. Don't bother scouting him. I got this covered. I'm just going to end the meeting here. Ugh. Oh, I'm not doing too badly at the moment. Striker is a problem position at the moment, but he's not leaving. Uh, does, it, does a good relationship with another manager help in these situations to perhaps make it easier to reject a transfer bid if it comes from a trusted friend? Uh, uh, I don't really know who he is. Uh, one to two days. He's fine. Blin is fine. Blin is absolutely fine. Oh, these bloody massive breaks are never fun, both from a, you know, playing a game, uh... Hold on, somebody has matched Jens's player of the match? Wow. I'm fairly sure he's from Club Bridger. Yeah, Sterling Sands, four-year deal with City. Ooh, 2-2. Two, two. Interesting. Yeah, Jens is not leaving. I don't care what they say. Scout. Keep scouting. Keep scouting. <laughs> you want us to sign Robin? I mean, I can't say he wouldn't be a good good player, but he's also wanting 61k at most. And he's also 36, so the board will be on my ass for that one. Knowledge. Keep scouting. Interesting. I mean, clearly... Clearly he's a centre mid. I don't know why you're giving me that. Uh, keep scouting. Keep scouting. Keep scouting. Keep scouting. Keep scouting. Interesting, but also a full back, and we have plenty of those. Full back. Go away. You're 29. You're 28. Could be interesting if Vandervoort doesn't improve. That said, he is improving at a uh, excellent rate, so I'm not actually that worried about that. 28. Ooh. He's on loan from Bayern at the moment, though, is the issue. I'm to shortlist. 29. Eh. I don't especially want to be... Uh, 
want to be signing fullbacks at the moment. Bill Way, 29 year old fullback, centre back, 31. And there we go. Yeah, I just I'm just not that interested in signing in signing, you know, close to thirty year olds or players for positions I already have plenty of depth in. AKA the defensive positions. Good depth at that. Like Because, I mean, the fact that he's starting for Australia is a very... What about, what happened to Matthew Ryan? Why, why is Vukovic still getting called up for the Australian national team at 35? But yeah, uh, where is it? squad depth. But yeah, four good players, which is all I need for this season. Maybe for next season I can have a look at it. Left back, got two decent, got two good players. Right back, got two good players. Uh, go to the forty-four. This is this is probably where where we'll need work, and this is where we'll need work. Because Paul and Dessas just can't lead the line on their own. Also, need a lot of work here. Paint still coming back will help that, I'm certain. Given enough time. But at the moment, it's just quite bad. It's just quite, quite bad. Uh, we have a match in two days, so... Actually, you can stay. I don't really care about you. Stay. Uh, unavailable. I don't think you were getting fitness anyway. Available. Available. You're on the bench now. You're fine. Available. Unavailable. The rest of you can stay there, frankly. Keep gaining fitness. Charleroi versus Zulte for Egan. Uh, ooh, Zulte Vrager and quite high. Charleroi are also quite high. Who do Bruja play next? Are they in the Buddy Champions League as well? They're managing to keep up this form even though they're in the Champions League. They are Andalek next. <laughs> and they're going to have an away game at Dynamo Kiev right before they play us. That can only help us, really. Wootless, you're doing nothing to change my mind at the moment, buddy. Absolutely nothing. Another good performance from uh, Zebley. I'm glad. I'm very glad. Who is he? I'm not very good right back. Well, not great right back. Uh, let's see. No. Hmm. Oh, he wants me to play four three three. Yeah, that's not happening. Oh, Thomas Buffell. I remember him. He's not a great. Yeah, he was a gank player for a really long time. Uh, I'm fairly sure I got rid of him in my first season because he was old. I do think I made him a scout or something, a scout or a coach or something. Like that, that, that will happen to Vukovic as well. I will offer him a job if he, you know, becomes a coach or a, becomes a staff member. I will offer him a job. We, I do believe in that. Whether he, you know. Except is a whole another thing. 
Press conference. Let's go. That's how I'm at against Vassal and Bavarian. Your team played very well. You must be helping the side carries that form into this next game. Uh, we know what we're capable of and have the confidence to go again. <laughs> oh, we have won in eight games. Uh, and are in 13th place. Have a lot of work left to do. Surely the game should be a good opportunity to add more misery to open season. I would say that we have an excellent chance. Uh, there has been something of an inquest at Open following a 4 0 defeat to Andelect in the last game. Surely this is the perfect time to play them. Uh, they're a little fragile after that defeat, and we have to take advantage of that. Uh, do you agree with. Agree with who is that? Beer Shop VA? Are they in Division 2? They're in the Pro League. Good for them. Uh, I don't really care. Do you have any sort of relationship with Benyat San Jose? Uh, no comment. Munoz has the intangible quality so many players look for in a leader. How much does that help you in the way you set your set up your team? Uh. As far as I'm concerned, he's integral to what we do, and I'd happily have a play team full of players like him. Let's go to the summary. Yeah, then that works. I just kicked my bin. <laughs> Try to put my feet up. Yeah, should be an interesting game. Fingers crossed we don't cock it up uh, the way we did that 2 2 against McAllen. Yeah. Let's see. Good. Smekins has signed a contract. That was only one year. No, it's three year. Three year. I just saw the 1K. Just saw the 1K. Yes, as I said, I mean we'll see. We'll see how the strikers do. Um, I like having Paul in the team in general because I think he, he, you know, works really well link up wise. Uh, I would just very much prefer to have a uh, an actual, you know, out and out goal scorer. Although I don't think Paul is, but. He's very much going to be working from crosses, and you know the higher up we get in terms of uh, oh, Cobran was sacked by Huddersfield. Where are they? Ooh, twenty third. Ooh. Sheffield Wednesday have had six points deducted, and they're still up in sixteen. <laughs> Not yeah, sixteen, <laughs> sixteen points. Okay, I accidentally got that right. Uh, yeah. Not going too well for Huddersfield, only two wins. <laughs> only two wins, but they're not that far behind. They can't get out of that. Uh, oh god, Bournemouth going straight up. I hate Bournemouth in this game. Not that I'll be probably be you know playing them at any point with Gank, but they are one of the banes of my existence um, when I manage Everton. FM absolutely adores them. Absolutely adores them for some reason. Damn it. Bloody, bloody Club Bruges beat Anderlecht. Damn you, Vacheron. Damn you to Hades. Which I'm sure at some point, once they figure out how to do it, uh, either Jack or Fuzzy will play on this channel. Because <laughs> they love that game. Me? I don't really care. Roguelites are not my thing. This is my thing. As much as I occasionally hate it. Uh, more deals, more deals. It's good. 
Good for Mela. Only two assists though in eight games. Hmm. Uh, yeah. It's fine. So, let's get going for the first match. Not happening. Not happening. Not happening. Oh, wait, no, that one is happening. Sorry, I expected to have to scroll down again. Team selection. Oh, that's why. Uh, why did it do that? That seems confusing. Uh, Blaine, I don't know if we can even put you in the bloody team at this point. Yeah, I'm not gonna. No point changing things. Come on, Dessas. I know what you, I know you can do well. Eh, he's unhappy. I'll get over it eventually. Or he'll leave, which, meh. <laughs> Considering the amount of centre backs, really good centre backs I've scouted, ah, uh, they'll they'll cope. Let's go to the match, and let's hope more frames aren't skipped. I forgot I turned crowd noise on. That was a shock. Gonna turn that down in my ears. Uh, first and foremost, we go do opposition instructions. Yordia Matt, where have I heard that name? Fairly sure he played for Swansea. Yes, he was at Swansea for five years. Uh, I see no reason in not doing that. How's his heading? He's a quickster. So, tightly mark him. Oh, playing 4 2 3 1. That's always annoying. Pace, tight marking. Tight marking. Uh, we'll do it to the fullbacks as well on the off chance. On the off chance that. They start trying to uh, overlap. So. Been a good run, so go and impress me. I have faith in you. I have faith in you. I have faith in you. It's amazing how well that works in general. Don't talk to people. Don't talk to... Uh, Reporters before the match. Yeah, 4 2 3 1 is frustrating. Let's see, got our 4 2 4, Toma and Patrick in the centre. And a win will just take us back up to three points away. Though a draw or a loss will put Zulte Varegum in touching distance. So, oh, it's raining. It's probably not going to help. On bon bon there. Send it in. Good block. Bye, Jens. Send that in. You had a good chance to send that in. That was poor. Okay, that's fine. Good job. Oh, good work, Bongonda. Got past his man very well there. My Paul, my Toma, go on, one of you, just bloody shoot. Good tackle, Questa. Fantastic tackle, son. Oh, um, you know, it's a good ball. That's what we want to use Paul for. Oh, that's a great ball. Ooh. Unlucky. I think he was actually trying to send that across and it got deflected into the arms of the goalkeeper. Good header, Lakumi. Unlucky, Toma. Good lad, Cuesta. So good. Go on, Dessers. That's fine. Corner. Corner. We can work with this. 
we can work with this. On your ends, good ball. Out of the way. What you're gonna do, Bongondo? You're gonna do nothing. Awesome. He got the throwing. It's been all us, but we need to get some shots on target. Come on. Pressure, pressure. Pressure. Good work, Lakumi. Go on, Mela. Good ball. Keep going. Go on, Bongonda. Get him, Bongonda. Lovely breakaway. Absolutely lovely breakaway. How can you think that football like that's not entertaining? Fullback pushed too far up. It's going to be a good day for our wingers, I think, because their fullbacks look like they're going to push up a lot. And we've got the pace to make them pay for it. Okay. That wasn't tight marking. Ooh. Good save, Van der Voort. Good save, but we need to put more pressure on them in defence. Well, that is only their first shot on target, I suppose. Good header away. Get out, get out, get out. That's not getting out. That's letting them get in a good pass. Good clearance, Patrick. Good work, Dessers. Ooh, unlucky. Unlucky. Pressure now, pressure. Get the tackle in. Uh not much to be done. Not much to be done about that, to be honest. Could have put more pressure on the striker or the guy shooting, but, you know. At the end of the day, those are just going to happen sometimes. Those are just going to happen. Just got to react to them. And react well. Now, scoring another goal would, would be good. Go on, Mela. Go on, Mela. Go on, Bunk on That's what I mean. That's what I mean. Good reaction, lads. Good reaction. I do love Mela. I really do. He's probably not going to lose his place for a while. Oh, that's just horrific defending. Really is. It's that Beck again. He's done so poorly. He really has in this first 15 minutes. Because he's... He's gone up too far letting Bongonda in. And he just completely missed doing anything with that ball. He just bounced off him. Good. Force him into those sorts of passes. That's good. Go on, Toma. Good ball. Jens. Go on, Jens. He has some space. Good pass. Paul, why aren't you in the box? Paul, you need to be in the box. You're the target man. Ooh, you let him past you. Go on, Lakumi. Good work, Lakumi. Great work. Go on, Bongonda. This is a lot of... Only on extended. This is a lot of highlights for the first, first 20 minutes. Yeah, that Beck has not been doing well. And yet he's he's, he's smiling about it. Because he's a bit thick, I would assume. Good ball, Akumi. Go on, Jens. Good ball! Get in! First goal for Mela. Yeah, it's not going too well for Open. Not going too well for Open. Good ball, Lakumi though. It's Beck again. <laughs> Doesn't stop the cross from coming in at all. I mean, a keeper should be getting to that, frankly. Keeper should be getting to a to a cross like that. It's gone right over his head, basically. I mean, I if it happened if it happened with uh, with Van der Voort, I would be disappointed that he didn't get that. Go on, Dessers. Good ball, good ball, unlucky Paul. Take the throw, take the throw. On Mela. Ball in. Unlucky Paul Beck again. Beck has also been now been booked. <laughs> this is this game is just not going very well for him. 
I feel a little bad. Don't tell me. Somebody make the run. Good walk. Good work, Jens. That was that was Jordi and Matt making that bloody block, not Beck. He's got a 6.2. <laughs> Unsurprisingly. The ball in the field is doing quite well, though. He has now been booked. So, maybe we can bait him into another yellow. Good ball, Toma. That was Paul. Paul Dessers. That was Paul. Almunos. Good work. Good work. Good ball. That, that was lucky, but it worked. Go on, Munoz. Ball. Unlucky Bongonda. Nearly got a hat trick in the first half. And that's half time. 3 1, uh, three -one Genk. Well, sucks to be him. I'll have to get used to it eventually. I'm not changing my I'm not changing my style, frankly. Uh, very happy with the way things are going. Keep it up, lads. I am. It's three one. And that oh <laughs> and Valo and Dre taking off at half time. That's not the best for them. Oh. Put it wide. Yeah, I, I, round of all had that regardless. Christ, already, already getting the highlight. Ball, little Miller. You got lucky there, Toma. As you didn't get lucky there, Patrick. That was just poor pass. Come on, in the midfield, do better. This is better. Go on, Dessers. Get in, Dessers. That was beautiful. I have a f suspicion that uh, if their centre-backs have been told to tightly mark, they're not doing it very well. Because Dessers and Paul are just finding all sorts of gaps between the centre-backs. Ah, they went to 4-5-1, and it's not helped them one bit. Oh, Adriano's not doing too well. Bit of a poor throw again there, but it's fine. Okay, we get the pressure on now. One lucky ends, but now you're at position. Back. Well done, Van der Voort. Well done. Well done, Martin. Oh, tell me. Better passing. Better passing. He walks straight into him there, and he's doing well, that KMB. Kiembe. Ooh. Not offside? No. Oh. Kiembe. It is Kiembe. Oh. 60 minute mark. So. Let's see who's tired. Oh, Gonda is tired. Let's get Daly on. Let's see again. Inverted winger attack. Inverted winger attack. There we go. Uh, nobody else is tied yet. Which is interesting. It's not doing so well. Patrick. Neither of the centre mids are doing well. Uh, unfortunately, I did just put one of them on a winger. <laughs> so. Uh, uh, Patrick or Toma for Hainan. Patrick or Toma for Hainan. Hainan. Let's go, Patrick. Let's go, Patrick. Uh, and we'll save the last one in case there's an injury in the last 30 or so minutes. They're getting in behind us. Which is not great. Good block. Should have gotten to that Bongonda. Should have gotten to that. Oh, Kayambe's got a high rating because he got the goal. That makes sense. Didn't think about that. 
Oh, look at me. You got lucky there. Ah. Uh, don't just blast her up with no plan. Good work, Jens. What? How was that a foul? Check far. That wasn't a foul. Clearly got the ball. Thank you. Thank you. Clearly got the ball there. The ball would shoot it off in the direction that Jens did. Been absolutely appalled if that had been a bloody penalty. Oh, those poor fullbacks have really not done well. Poor, poor fullbacks. Tomer, come on. You're better than that. Come on, look at me. It's alright, that's alright. Can be dealt with. Good header away. Only about 15 seconds left. A good block. Let's go. Go on, Dessers. See what you can do. Or just, you know, hold it up. It doesn't really matter. Fall one up. Well played, lads. Well played. Yeah, centre mids didn't do well. Centre mids did not do well. Well then, lads. Uh, I felt confident the game was won, and we have some important fixtures coming up that Theo needs to be fresh for. Uh, Bong on to strike, give you an early lead there. Did you feel it would be a good day for your side when you saw that one go in? An early goal is always a bonus, and it helped us on our way. Now we prepare for Brugge. Brugge? I think it's Brugge. Now we prepare for Brugge. Oh, Pencil is injured. Oh well. Now on form. Columbia boss. Six games unbeaten. Go to the press conference. Uh, Kaimbe scoring a powerful shot into the bottom corner. I guess your team was particularly impressive. What did you make of it? Uh, there's not a lot you can do when goals like that go in. Mailer will be leaving. No, he won't. Ah, that's a press conference. Okay. Fair enough. How long is he injured? Four or six weeks. Not bad. A bit more concerned if it was, you know, a bloody ACL or something like that. Zebley signed the new deal. That's good. Nobody agrees with Wooters, so I'm not too concerned. Nobody, <laughs> nobody thinks he's in the right on this one. So you can sort off. Uh, Roots has gone on record in stating his desire to go on loan in order to play some play first team football. Is that something you're prepared to allow? Uh, I don't think it's likely right now. He's got a better chance of playing here than he has of featuring regularly elsewhere, which is not true. Do you think his apparent refusal of de his demands will give reason for other players in the squad to become unhappy? Uh, is there f if they are, they're free to come to me with their concerns. My decision here needn't be indicative of an overall approach to things. Let's go. I just think I'm just friends with Martin van der Valk because we're both a similar age. In game, anyway. Uh Encoding really does not like the uh, the loading screen, does it? So we've been unbeaten for five games at home. <laughs> really? I can only think they must have been draws. Oh lord, they haven't won since September. No, not even at September since August. 
Oh lord. That's that's not going to go well for their manager. That is not going to go well for their manager. We've got some more professional contracts signed. Ah. So now we just go ahead to Brugge game. Question is, how do I approach this? It's Mailer. Not Mailer. I was looking at him. Brugger. are clearly, you know, a good team. They're unbeaten at this, at this point. Which is not the hardest thing to do in this, uh, in this league. But you'd be surprised at... Uh, they did actually beat Kiev at home. They drew away to... Saint Germain. Ooh. They did get beaten 3 1 by. They did get beaten 4 1 on aggregate by uh, Benfica and then lost 2 0 to. 2 0 to Saint Germain. Did not do well in that. Obviously, they got Kiev coming up. Let's see how they're doing against Kiev. Uh, and they play a four-two-three-one, which is my least favorite formation to try and uh, try and set up against. Uh, how is other? Damn it! Liverpool are at the top again. Or oh, still, as the case may be. Everton down in a in seventh, eleven games played. Not doing too badly. Not doing too badly. Interestingly, when I started my uh, Everton career to you know just test uh, test this FM out, uh, the assistant manager who is who is Carlo Ancelotti's son went with Carlo. Which is which is quite an interesting uh, little feature, I thought. Thought. I mean, as you've seen here, when you take over at the start, usually the uh, this man just stays with you. Good lad, Bongonda. Good lad, Mailer. Thank you, Theo. Thank you. Yeah, that was going to happen. It's good. 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 If you think so. Uh, progressing well, that's good. I mean, there's not much I can really do about those two things right now. Right, let's go. So, this will be... Once this day is over, we get to see how Brigger did. Hmm. Hopefully they played all their players, got a couple of them injured, and lost heavily. So I can dream, can't I? <laughs> so. Uh, hmm. Well, he's got good potential, is the thing. So I don't really want to let him go. Uh, so. Now, go away. How did they do... They won one nil. Right. That's not. It's not brilliant. Must be said. And they don't play us again until April, which is going to be bloody tense as hell. Uh, they don't want to sell him though. It's the issue. He's just not very good. He. It's 29. I said the board will crucify me if I do that. Uh, keep scouting him. Keep scouting him. Keep scouting. 
keep scouting, keep scouting, keep scouting, keep scouting. Keep scouting. Keep scouting. Oh, he's already been scouted 100%. Okay. Keep scouting. Go away, 30 year old. That one's an interesting one, but again, uh, keep scouting. Try and get that up. Keep scouting. Keep scouting. Keep scouting. Keep scouting. Keep scouting. Scout. Keep scouting. Keep scouting. It's going to be an issue. That's going to be an issue, of course. Uh, what to do about Club Brugge? What to do about them? Do I keep with the winning formation, or do I go more defensive? Take in and out and put Blin in. And I'm going to go up balanced. Those are the only changes I'm going to make. Blin allows for, uh, for us to go to 4 3 3 if need be. Which obviously, you know, that's if necessary. Uh, and just you know, going to going to balanced instead of positive will just hopefully, fingers crossed, touch, whatever the hell the surface I'm leaning on is. Uh, hopefully make it less open. Okay, he's terrible. He's not great. He's very good. That's shortlist. He's very tall as well, which is good. Very tall. Again, we will see if uh, if Martin needs replacing. I don't think he will. I think he's doing fine on his own. But obviously, all we can do is. And I'll see and see what happens. Mm. I have potential to get through four games this uh, this stream, which is going to be quite good. Obviously, we've got the midweek one as well. Yeah, they're above us, attacking, and they're. They face more shots, but they've also conceded fewer goals. Uh, this is going to be a really tough game. I'm not sure how it's going to go, honestly. I'm looking for him. Too expensive. Too, too expensive at this stage. Drees, come on. Stop throwing a bloody hissy fit. And though it dropped fourth. What are the rules on that then? Uh Where are they? Uh, 
Where is it? It should tell me. Oh, that's why. Uh, where is it? Interesting. Games won. Ah, results over Egan with one, uh, one more game than uh, Anderlecht. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, good. Good, good, good. Uh, I'm going to go with Bomb Van Loon. Good. And Trevor Dogan. He's 21 years old. Good. That's done. Yeah. Hmm. Yes, I'm aware that that is going to be a, uh, a problem area. Okay, press conference. You could make a real statement about your intentions in this match and go on the attack from the first whistle. How will you approach this game? Uh, I ain't telling you jack. Your owner has been tipped to be in with a shout of being named Golden Boot. How do you rate his chances? I think he deserves to win it. He's been absolutely brilliant, and that sort of recognition doesn't come along very often, so I hope he gets it. Subol has been named, has been one of... Brugger's best players this season. Where would they be without him, in your opinion? I'm talking about my team, buddy. Uh, can you be confident of a good performance against Brugger in such good recent form? Uh, I'm gonna, it's just going to have to be honest. They are a good team. We have to respect them and see how the match goes. Uh, does it add pressure given the hunger for result? Uh, I don't think so. Uh, the lads will all have that extra bit, bit of extra desire, though. Which you only get from matches like this. Managers often crack under pressure. You seem to be handling it well. Can the same be said of Philippe Clement? Clement. Uh, all I know is that we are all. We are well up for this match, and if he thinks he is feeling fresher now, he's going to be feeling a lot more after we beat them. How important will Paul be? Uh, this is a sort of match. Well, let's go. Yes, put pressure on the opposition manager. As I said, I love playing mind games with the opposition manager. It's always fun. Always, always fun. So let's see how he reacts to that in general, you know, before the match, and how the team reacts to it during the match. I'm hopeful, frankly. No, I don't. No reaction as of as of yet. Has to, he has to be asked about it, right? Or did they do his press conference first? Come on. Give me the reaction I want. Which is, you know, a bad one. And also, this is, this is the game I've been most nervous for. Because uh, this is going to be very big. In terms of the season as a whole, of course, it doesn't even it 
doesn't even particularly matter, I don't think, if we finish top. It's whether we finish top of the uh, of the group after it splits, whether we win the title or not. So, I suppose it doesn't really matter, but, you know, I want to get the good impression going. Good response, that's good. Uh... Hmm. 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 Do I want to go for somebody who's good in what just one uh, one aspect, or do I want to go for the most sort of balanced, most balanced? You're not getting that much, Sonny. Three point two. Fair enough. Start off then. Oh, it's Jeremy Mathieu. Do I remember him? Vaguely. Uh, I'm going to continue the advert then. Going to continue that advert. Actually. Now that I think about it, uh, available, 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 unavailable, unavailable, because you're all going to be playing, uh, playing midweek, you lot, so, okay, okay, let's, genuinely, I'm, I've, <laughs> I'm feeling nervous. Uh, because this could very well decide this first part of the season. I, I mean, I'm not going to get sacked if I lose. No way in hell. Doing far too well for their standards. But... I want this. I want to win this. I very much want to win this, especially considering this is the home game. We really should be winning this. Oh, come on, laptop. Please load. You're doing nothing to help my nerves. Uh, well, I didn't do well. I consider... Yeah, anything below 6.7 to be not doing well. Which, you know, maybe isn't fair, but oh well. Face 27 is the issue. 27. Right then, Zolte Varegum did win, so they are a point behind us. Which sort of ranks up, the, cranks up the pressure even more. Do it. This could be rough. Kumi and Questor are getting a good partnership going. Yeah, I agree with this. Let's -a go. Yeah, they've been having that those issues from the start. Let's go. Let's go. So let's go to opposition instructions again. I'm tempted to try and smother him. I am very tempted to try and smother him. Go for the full smother. 
type marking, weak foot, close you down, you're slow, you won't be able to get past anyone, you're quick, so type marking, weak foot, type marking, weak foot, type marking, weaker foot. Right. I want you to pick up where you left off last time out. I have faith in you. I have faith in you. I have faith in you. Oh. Don't talk to reporters. Don't talk to reporters. So we've got our four two three our four two four. They've got their four two three one. Which I really, really hate. Top of the table clash. Top of the table clash. Draw written all over it. That would not be helpful to either of us. And we're live. Ooh. Interesting ball colour. Come on, lads, you can do this. Ooh. Not the best start. Not the best start. Would have preferred that pass to go through. And Equester has been yellow carded already for his first foul. I'm sure that was fair. No, I don't. No, I'm not. Good ball. Go, Mela. Ooh, unlucky Von Gonda. Got under it. Didn't get didn't get over it. Got under it. Questy, you need to work on your heading, son. Don't disagree with the clearance there, though. Pressure, pressure, pressure. Good blocks. Go on, Dessas. Good ball. Go on, Bongonda. Go on, counter, counter, counter. Played across. It's all right, that's all right. Showing them they should be worried, though. Showing them they should be worried on the counter. We're dominating possession as well. Well, got better possession at the moment. Go on, pressure, pressure, pressure. Good, good, good. That was a stupid pass from them. Good ball, good ball. Go on. Ah, oh, Toma. That was poor. That was poor, Toma. That was poor. You know it was. I had better options and you didn't pick it, either of them. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn it all to hell. Needed to get a tackle in there. And then bloody... Is that Lakumi? Lakumi dove in and just opened up for him. Can't be doing that, Lakumi. Can't be doing that. Ah, come on! So just... Nothing balls. Good work, Bongonda. Ah. Damn it, now they've got it back. And now they're countering. Get back, Munoz. Good lad, Jens. Go on, Bongonda. Good lad. Go on, Dessers. It's alright, that's alright. Good ball. Go on, Mela. Go on, Paul! Oh. See what I mean? We need a striker. We need a striker capable of putting those away. The way they have Kermenchik, whatever his name is. He's capable of putting. Oh, bloody hell. They're doing the way every time they get bleep pass off. 
Well saved, Van der Voort. Uh, well held. Good job, Martin. Good job. Oh, fuck off. Oh, Lord. I don't like this. Get to him. Get to him. It's not getting to him. Oh. This has not been a good per first half performance at all. Been a very poor first half performance. Right. Take this is off of Blin. Blin is let's see half back. Okay, so that's that's correct. Playmaker, defensive line playmaker. Okay. Yeah, I think I've got to do that. Show me something else in the second half. Not happy with the defensive work. Not happy with the playmaking. And not happy with the finishing. Come on, lads. You're better than this. You're far better than this. You know you are. Vlad Toma. I'll mean yours. Ah. Inexact balls. Inexact balls. Come on. Good lad, Blaine. That's what having him on ads. Go on, Mela. It's alright. Go on. Go on, Paul. Go on, Mela. Come on. Get a good ball in now, Jens. Get a good ball in. Don't have a good enough strike to put those away. Really don't. And I like, I do like Paul. I think he adds, the, adds, adds a lot to the team. Just doesn't have the striker's instinct. Ah, I was never going in, thankfully. God, it's been three minutes and still so many fucking highlights. Oh, Mela. Oh, Mela. What are you doing? What are you doing, lads? Come on, be offside. Be offside. Thank the Lord, because that was close. That should have been 2-0. That should have been 2-0. Frankly. Absolutely horrific play. Have to do better than this, lads. What is the point of that? What is the point? Miller. What happened to tight marking? Taken control of this game. They have taken control of this game. Miller to fall, to fall back. Bring on Ito. Bring on Daly for Patrick.
That's a good ball. Go on, Toma. Go on, Ito. Good ball. Go on, Bongonda. Send it in. Go on, Daly. Oh. Ah. Go on, Jens. Good throw. Good work. Go on, Blinn. Go on, Daly. Yes. Go on, Mela. Oh. I just get so many bloody sods between the fucking ball. Oh. Good lad, Mela. Go now, Ito. Go. Oh, it's never going in from there. Never going in. Come on, Gonda. Come on, Paul. Penalty. Uh. Gonna have to take the chance here. Come on, Questa. Come on. Right, well, Paul. Come on, Gonda. Pull it back. Thomas played horrifically. Thomas has played horrifically. Got very attacking. It's all I can do at this point. I've made all my changes. Go on, Paul. Go on, Paul. Find him. Go, Bongonda. Go, go, go. Send it across. Uh. Go on, Jens. Oh. Come on. Go on, Daly. Go on, Jens. Ah. Uh. I think that's it. I think that's it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. I mean, there's not much to be said. He just... Toma didn't... didn't do anything. Patrick didn't do anything while he was on. Bongonda was terrible. Mela, who's usually one of our most consistent performers, didn't do enough. Kumi and Cuesta were poor. Fact is that Martin was our best player. comment so I made the decision <sighs> generally very frustrating very very frustrating this is why we need a striker this is why we need a striker or anything else a striker who can just make something happen that means we have to you know Sell somebody to get the funds for it. So be it. So fucking be it. Oh, fuck off. Cancel that assignment. I'm 
Yeah, give, give me especially good players. Uh, this is striker, isn't it? Yeah. Conditions. Nobody. Still nobody. The only one who comes close to that is. Uh, Okay, that's better. That's better. Too expensive. Twenty nine. That's the issue again. Yeah, I mean, uh, I just. I see an orange. I mean, who's on a short list? That much better to be honest. Uh, mm. Right, some interest. Feared, basically, that's what I feared. Certain point there. Uh, oh, that's only four people. Christ. Okay. I'll we'll have to do that. It's not any better. Right. Uh, what about people who are transfer listed? Again. Scout report for them. Uh, I think we go to the next game. I was your own in this 125th appearance for Genk. How how important a player has been for the club. It's a great achievement. It shows what a servant, wonderful servant, Jens has been to this club and its fans. I want 
to comment on individual performances. Um, not saying much, honestly. That's f very frustrating, honestly. Very, very frustrating. Uh, let's go back to positive. Let's do the changes now. Munoz is going to have to play uh, Cuesta for DeVaste. Rutas for Lukumi. Artiega. Uh, let's see. Christian and Bue. Ito and Daly. And then put Garno in for Paul. Keep Dessas on or do we? And Bombay in for Dessas. Bombay in for Dessas. Garno, you're going to be an attacking. Right, let's go through. He should be fine. Uh, debased. No nonsense. Centre back stopper. Rooters, central defender, defend. Artiega is wing back, defend. We need a wing back support instead. Bue is a box to box. Christian is a deep line playmaker. Ito, support. He's the inverted winger attack, if I remember correctly, and then that's set. Oh, yeah. I mean, there's there's not much I can really say. Uh, I'm disappointed in that result. To be sure, I'm sure the board are as well. Yeah. We need we need a striker. We need a really good striker. We need a really good attacking player. We've got good defensive players. We need one an attacking player who you know is able to conjure something out of nothing. Uh, whether I'll be able to get that in this season, I don't know. Uh, It is what it is. I need, um, I mean, at this point, I need Brugger to slip up at some point. Because I obviously already has. Have. We has. We have. Uh. Root has clearly been trying to force a move away from Genk in order to get the playing time he deserves. And he was manager intent to handle the situation. He's a good player. Someone we want to keep at the club. Hopefully we can reach a resolution that suits all parties parties as soon as possible. That's all that can really be said to that. I mean the good thing that's come out of this stream is I've been keeping an eye on the skipped frames due to encoding lag. I don't believe it's uh, happened. Great. I don't believe it's happened during the games. It's it's happened when I've been loading, of course, but you know, not much can be done about that. So. But uh, outside of the game or inside during the actual matches it seemed quite good so fingers crossed certainly fingers fingers crossed generally very still very annoyed about that Brugge game I know we're better than that is the worst part I know we're better than that Hmm. 
actually. Ask him to recommend signing. Maybe he'll give us a bloody striker. Maybe he'll give us a bloody good striker. What I might need to do once we... Well, I should probably do it as soon as possible, really, shouldn't I? Uh, I need to look at the scouting staff, basically. And... Because at the moment, they're just giving me the same players, all of them. I mean, if I look at the scouting staff. Good judging player potential. But if I look at the look at the scouts, uh, the mental attributes. I mean, somebody like that. Is, I mean, in general, it's not really good enough. Uh, let's just look at them. You know, Belgium, France, Holland. 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 I'm just getting the same three countries from these guys. You know, it's Belgium, France, Holland. Belgium, France, Holland. Belgium, France, Holland. Belgium, France, Holland. The issue, of course, is is that honestly, it'll probably require a massive, massive uh, Belgium, Holland, France. It's going to require a massive clean out because obviously, even if I get rid of six of these sods, uh, still won't be considered good enough. And these two, I think. Just need to go. Now, that brings us down to 10. Brings us down to 10. I need to get rid of four more. Uh... Oh, this is Joss's brother. Forgot about him. He's not great, is he? Not great. Uh... Okay. Anyone under 10 for any of the judgings I'm going to get rid of. Uh, this is going to put me in a right old shit show of place. I'll keep him actually, because he's got the second best. But Mace, I'm just gonna have to terminate that. Damn the cost. He put and Remy. What does that leave me on? terms of numbers. Still have one over is the issue. Get rid of the two elevens. This might seem uh a bit drastic, I'm sure. Which 
one to get rid of maze. No, gone. Yeah, this likely seems drastic, but I'm not. I know I need a striker, and you know I'm not getting. Right. Let's see. Who else can we get rid of? Right, okay. Uh, staff search. Well, um, let's step. Place advert. Scouts. And recruitment analysis. Analysis. Right. Uh, do it. Team selection. Let's go. Make sure. Uh, let's actually get Bongonda out of there and put on bench. Hannon, he needs the fitness. All right, let's go. Got a match. They'll get over it. They'll get over it eventually. So yeah, play this match and then call it a day for the stream. Uh, go out there, relax, play a natural game. The result will come. Faith in you. I have faith in you. I have faith in you. Let's go. Kick off. Skip. It's going to be interesting to see how Lim Bombay does. Be interesting to see how Lim Bombay does. Oh, that was a good header. On daily. Lucky. Back up and pressure. Good header away. Now push out. Got to push out. Tackle. Go on, Ito. Go, go, go. Not the best ball in, son. Find him again. Unlucky Lim Bombay. Unlucky. Good play, though. Good play. Find Artiega. Well, Artiega decided not to do anything with it. Fantastic. Uh. Organo. Artiega. Might have to sell one of the strikers, actually, now that I think about it. Wasn't bad, Artiega. That's better. Let's try to send it in. Go on, Daly! More power on that, and that goes in. Ball on the volley. It's uh, Borgano. Oh, Lim Bombay. Lim Bombay should be scoring that, son. You're only about a yard out. Good lad, Munoz. Romito. Offside. Yes. No. Take it, Limbombe. Take it. Take it with both bloody hands. That was an absolute clusterfuck. That's a Bue. Bue heads in. I think he was onside when Gano made his shot, to be fair. So, <laughs> Gardo shoots into one of their centre backs and ricochets off into uh, Limbombe's path. Who, I'm not sure if he even like 
actually swung a foot at it. I think he just sort of was running forwards and uh, <laughs> it hit him. La Munoz. On Limp Bombay. Unlucky. Pressure now, though. Pressure. 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 Vlad Artiega. On Christian. On Daly. Oh, good work, Limp Bombay. Second goal for him. Good work. Again, lucky to get the ball at his feet, but, you know. Can't deny the work he's doing once it does reach his feet. Can't deny it at all. Lad Wooters. Good lad Wooters. Oh, that's poor. That's poor defence. Come on, centre backs. That is terrible. You've just let him in there. Absolutely let him in there. Look at this. Nobody near him. Nobody near him. That is very, very poor. Go on, Daly. Go on. Good lad, Artiega. Good, 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 good. Now send it in. Get in. Again. Complete and utter... Complete not to cluster fuck in the box. I mean, I'm glad we're scoring, but we should do it, should really be doing it first time. Just abs they're absolutely packing the box, as as Brugger did. To be fair, just weren't able to get the bloody shot away on that on that one. It's going well. Let's go. I'm disappointed in the conceding the goal, but we replied at least, so it's fine. Vlad Devaced, gone Limbombe, and Limbombe's gone down. Oh, Lord. Fine. Paul, on you come. You're not playing false nine, though. Not got a lot of pace is the issue. He's 201 centimetres. My God, why are we not sending more crosses in? <laughs> no, you're also going for uh, target man attack. You're 201 centimetres. How have we not noticed that before? You tall, tall bastard. That's disappointing for Limbombe. Because he's doing really well. Doing really, really well. Good. Shite goal kick. On Artiega. Go on. If he's on side, I'll be very surprised. Okay, he was. Jesus Christ. They're so bad at dealing with the ball when it's in the box, these lot. <laughs> that should have really been caught. That should so have been caught. Go on, Daly. Lad. Go on, Christian. Good work, good work. Good. Got. You had space. You got space now. One of you send it in. Got 
pull. Uh, Good inception, Ortega. Go on now, Ito. You haven't done much of this game, lad, but it's okay. Go on, Munoz. Go on, Christian, hit that! We will uh, make some changes now. Miller is on the bench. That's good. So I can stick him on. Uh, Phelps is tired. Dale is the one most likely to get a game, so we will stick on. Oh, is Mel my only. Oh. Oh boy. Uh. Dale, you're gonna have to stick it out. <laughs> gonna have to stick it out, Daly. My bad. This one's on me. I did assume that Lim Bombay would still be on. Uh, actually, apparently Jens is our best bloody uh, winger, so have at it, Jens. Have at it. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Jens, good ball. Not a good ball. Not a good ball. I haven't been many fouls this game, though, to be fair, so that's good. It's good for us, anyway. Well done. Get on in now. Oh, it's never going in. <laughs> They're leaving early. I don't blame them. Do not blame them one bit. Go on, Jens. Good ball. Go on, Paul. Job going Ito. Nah, it's never going in. Tame shot. Tame, tame shot. Get to it, Boue. Go on, Christian. Go on, Artiega. Good ball. It's unlucky there were so many people in bloody front of Paul there. Go on, Artiega. Well done. Go on. Go on. Make the run. That's good. Send it across. Get in, Garno. Get in, Garno. He deserves a goal, to be fair. Just waiting for Mela to make that run there. That's a superb cross. Leapt like a salmon. And in it goes. In it goes. Oh, Paul. Unselfish. I like that. Good job, Garno. Well, good job, Paul, for being unselfish. Good job, Garner, for putting it away. I mean, he's completely unmarked. This is very poor from them. Very poor. Six goals from 13 shots is not bad. It's not bad at all. On Mela. Good header. Get after it now. Good job, Abue. On Christian. Find somebody. Not who I thought you'd find. You have a second chance. It's a good ball. Go on, Artiega. Send it in. Or you, Christian. Go on. Unlucky. Good job, Artiega. Unlucky. Now I got close. Well played, lads. Well played. Good win. Good win. I'm lucky Limbombe having to come off because you were doing really well that first half. <sighs> Let's see how long he is out. 
Uh, I'll leave it to the physio three or four weeks. Right then, uh, I'm gonna save this. That's all we are gonna cover today. Another three games. Good wins against Oipen and uh, Liège. Disappointing win again. Disappointing loss. Sorry, against Brugge. Uh, we've also, you know, we're approaching Christmas in game. Approaching Christmas uh, <laughs> in real life as well. Six points behind. That's so frustrating. Uh, we've had a rehaul of the recruitment team. We're looking for another coach as well. I'm going to try and see once I've got two more scouts in if I can maybe increase the scouts. I mean, at the end of the day, you know, we knew that uh, we had issues we needed to solve. We haven't been able to solve them yet. Uh, let's see, where's the loan thing? Where's loans? I want to check who's out on loan. Uh, where is loans? Where are loans? The dev center? Yes, it is. So, how I wish I could recall one of these guys. Uh, so you know, you know, we've got Odie coming back. At some point. Right, but be still be something. We've got Nigren coming back, Bromo coming back. Anyway, so uh, for the future, all future streams on Thursday, Christmas Eve. Well, Christmas Day for me. Uh, Christmas Eve, um, we will be. We'll have our Christmas special. So I'll be talking, like we did for Halloween, we'll be talking about uh, Christmas episodes, Christmas movies, probably some of our own traditions for Christmas. It'll definitely be Jack and I there. Lockstar will probably take part as well. We're going to see if we can get Fuzzy. He's been a little bit uncontactable at the moment. Um, we're also going to see if we can get some people together to play some Among Us this weekend. Uh, as for my solo streams, I'm going to try and play another game at some point. Uh, obviously, we'll st still be doing, you know, the two-hour streams, Football Manager, every Tuesday. But I'll try and find another day and another game that I can play that isn't too hard on my computer so that the quality doesn't crap out like it has been for this. Uh, might be Return of the Oberdeen. Might be Return of the Oberdeen, because that's not a particularly intensive game, as far as I know. So, you'll be able to see how bad I am at that one, because I am quite... I'm probably going to be quite bad at that. <laughs> I've, I did watch a stream of it a little while ago, well, when it first came out, I think. Um, so I don't really remember much of it. Uh, but I do know it's about mysteries. I'm probably going to be quite bad at doing that under pressure. Anyway, uh, thank you anyone who has been, you know, watching along live. Thank you for anyone who watches the archives. Again, I know I say this every week. Please, please, please give us a follow. Uh, you know, subscribe to the YouTube channel for archives as well. I know the these streams haven't been going up. Uh, I need to have a chat with Fuzzy and Logstar about that. But I will, you know, try and do it. Uh, that's all I've got. So, again, thank you for watching. And I will see you uh, 